How's it going YouTube? I'm Waterfields1. Welcome to this week's PlayStation 4 News, your weekly update on everything PlayStation. Not a whole lot happening this past week, however, let's do it. First up this week, Assetto Corsa con Assimilaciones is coming to the PS4 this April. Now this is the widely recognized number one racing simulator of the moment. It's available on Steam. It looks incredible. It's going to run at 1080p and 60 frames per second on the PlayStation 4. Now it's a Certo Corsa Cunas Simulaciones. I'm fluent in Italian, as you can clearly see, but this racing simulator is coming to the PlayStation 4 this April. It looks awesome. Blizzard have announced that the beta for Overwatch has been delayed by one month. Now, it was originally planned for release in January. It's going to be with us in February, and for once, it's actually a good reason for a delay. They plan to add a new mysterious game mode to the beta because they're just saying, we want to give you as much content as possible in the beta. We want to get this game properly tested. Tested, which I respect. I respect that approach from Blizzard Games. It's coming in February. That's the beta for Overwatch. Drive Club's getting a pretty big update this February. It's going to get hardcore mode, which removes traction control, stability control, and all assists. It's just you the controller and whatever the game's programmed to do people that's it so drive club is going hardcore in terms of racing simulation you can have no help whatsoever if you want a new challenge that's drive club hardcore mode coming in february the horror sensation layers of fear will be released on the playstation 4 on the 16th of february now, this is the pt inspired psychological horror game it looks interesting it's available on steam now however it will be on the playstation 4 on the 16th 16th of February. PlayStation 2 Classics Jedi Starfighter, Bounty Hunter and Star Wars Racers Revenge are available now on the PlayStation Store for the PlayStation 4. They will cost you £7.99p each. Now these are the games that were included in the Star Wars Battlefront console bundle. However, they're now readily available to everyone and if you did, like me, own them before on the PlayStation 2, you still have to buy them again. Warner have announced the Mortal Kombat Game of the Year edition. It's called Mortal Kombat XL. It includes all the DLC, including the upcoming DLC pack, and it'll be released on the 4th of March, 2016. Indie title Prison Architect is officially coming to the PlayStation 4. It has a release window of spring, this year and this is one of those games that I think it just looks so much fun it looks awesome it looks original it looks different and it's what I want to play prison architect it's hitting the PlayStation 4 this spring everyone should check their email boxes right now because Sony have sent out one day PlayStation Plus memberships to everyone as way of a compensation for the 4th of January 2016 blackout from PSN now they've still yet to acknowledge why PSN was down rumors suggest a DDoS attack it could have been anything however i'm happy sony aren't acknowledging the reason for it being down if it was a ddos attack if it was a hack then why give those people the attention they want they want to be famous they want to be named and shamed so good on sony for just giving us our compensation and just carrying on happy days believe it or not that is it for this week's show if you enjoyed hit that thumbs up button if there's any stories out there that i missed leave them in the comment section below and share it with everybody if you're new around here hit that subscribe button only you can help the channel to grow onwards and upwards if you're not new around here then thank you so much for all your support you guys are fantastic share it on twitter share it on reddit share it absolutely everywhere and let's get this place moving onwards and upwards people let's do it Anyway, thank you for watching, enjoy your gaming week, I've been Waterfields1, see you later.